According to the Christopher and Dana Ree Foundation, nearly one in 50 people are living with paralysis. Until now, there wasn't much hope, but a new study involving stem cells has doctors and patients excited. Two years ago, Brenda Garris's life changed forever. They told me that I uh, went into a ditch and was ejected out of the vehicle. The accident left the 26-year-old paralyzed from the waist down and confined to a wheelchair. And I don't feel any of my lower body at all. Brenda has traveled from Kansas to UC San Diego to be the first patient to participate in a groundbreaking safety trial testing stem cells for paralysis. We are directly injecting the stem cells into the spine. The stem cells come from fetal spinal cords. The idea is when they're transplanted, they'll develop into new neurons and bridge the gap created by the injury by replacing severed or lost nerve connections. They did that in animals and doctors are hoping for similar results in humans. The ultimate goal, to help people like Brenda walk again. The ability to walk is obviously a big deal, not only in quality of life issues, but uh, it also affects your survival long term. Brenda received her injection and will be followed for five long years. She knows it's only a safety trial, but she's hoping for the best. I hope to get up and to get walk again. Any little change, any little hope is enough for all of us.